If you're having a hard time choosing what kind of Bernard gun, these things are essentially handmade to order however you want. It might be a little overwhelming to, to kind of figure out what amperage, what length. First thing I usually start off with asking is what welding machine do you have? For example, if you have an XMT 350, probably a safe bet to run a anywhere from a 300 amp to a 400 amp gun, depending on how much you're using it. It's occasional use, you could probably get away with on the lower amperage side. If you're using it a lot, I would go higher, like a, like a, a 400 amp. Most common is probably 15 feet. Now with a 15 foot, there's two different types of cables on the inside of the gun. There is Hytrel, it's kind of a plastic based material, and that's where your liner goes through. And if you want something longer, like a 25 foot gun, I usually recommend going with the steel center. It just avoids, if you have a long gun, you probably run the risk of kinking your cable. Having a steel cable is gonna make it more resistant to getting kinked. Also, depending on the machine, if you have a small little welding machine, you can't go very long because the drive motor might be a little small to push wire through a 15 foot gun. So in that case, going to a, um, a 10 foot gun, for example, would be a good option. But if you ever have any trouble trying to pick what's right for your machine, you could always call us at Christian Electric and we'd be more than happy to help you out.